show you how to make a new model starting from scratch setup using the Aura Wizard. If you have your Aura handy, you can connect it. It'll tell it what type of Aura you have. Otherwise, go File, New Aura Config File, and tell it what type of Aura you have. In this case, it's an open stock. Click OK. Give it a name, such as Edge 540 for our model. The con config type, usually you'll do a custom, but we will build in presets for models we develop and so forth, such as the Ventique. Control template will give you a head start on your gains and your control algorithms and your dual rates and expos. Pick the model that most matches yours. You can say generic 3D since it's a 3D aircraft. Servo type, analog or digital being the choice. If you don't know, click analog. You can change it in the servo ports tab. Throttles, if you use your receiver bus, you can say no throttle on Aura, or you can do a single or double throttle. Wing type, many to choose from, including elevons, flaperons, and so forth. We're going to have two aileron servos. Tail type, many choices again. We're going to do one elevator, one rudder servo, but there are V-tails and other types available. For the orientation, you can uh, change it to any perpendicular orientation. We're going to basically mount ours in the default type orientation. Transmitter type, fairly self-explanatory, but this is going to be a spectrum using remote receivers. And we're going to use one, and it's going to be in many port A. Now you can see it populates the servo ports. It tells you where you'll plug in your different control surface servos. You can make note of it. They're also visible in the servo port tab. Finishing that, you'll be able to save it to your hard disk. Here we'll do edge 540, and we'll do B as like a second version. Save. Now it puts you in your Aura config tool and basically allows you to view and fine tune your settings.